Hello and welcome back to another Kingdoms Forlorn video. So uh, after we have defeated Princess Fala, uh, you know, we came back, uh, you know, to the south, to the south port, to town, uh, you know, the main hub of our uh, level. So let's uh, let's see. First thing we are going to do is visit the uh, Iron Eric's Iron Works, and this is Eric the blacksmith. So uh, we can talk to him, ask him a couple of questions. We, we can learn some skills like bodybuilding, leather armor, uh, which will be useful later on. Unfortunately, right now we don't have enough money. Uh, so what we are going to do is sell. So let's uh, let's sell. A couple of things we are going to sell this sword and this and this shield so pretty much anything that we are not using and that is not enchanted uh, we are going to sell this one we do not need see 40 gold it's a pretty good price for it uh, let's see chainmail we don't need it we don't need this one either mm -hmm. yeah we're not gonna use uh, spears Although this is a very good spear, as you can see, it's imbued with uh, water damage, so it would add water damage, and with inner fire, it would add additional fire damage as well. So that damage would, you know, stack, and it would be incredible. Un unfortunately, we cannot do it. Uh, I'm gonna keep this chain just in case I have enough uh, money to train Zoltan into using chain. Uh, and here we go. The, here we. This is we. This is the part where we're gonna identify the best ones. Well, okay. This is a good one. This is uh, this is actually uh, a nice bow for our cleric. Uh, unfortunately, she's not gonna use it as a bow. She's just gonna use it for its uh, statistics, mostly magic damage. It will add magic damage. Uh, this one is wow attack rating great uh, so we'll give this one to our ranger uh, she will make good use of it and yeah we're gonna learn teach uh, Serena the sorceress uh, leather she's gonna also gonna wear this one uh, okay well magic damage 2 this one is magic damage 2 and critical magic damage to attack rate okay I'm gonna I'm just gonna use this one I'm gonna sell this one sell this one okay I'm okay it seems we got another legendary mace same as before and that's it we sold most of our items uh, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna equip uh, you know so he has the, the same mace uh, it has good block rating lock and health regen which is good but this one gives us uh, all stats and fire damage so it will plus it has better attack rating as you can see so it will be that it will definitely be more useful okay I'm just gonna keep this one here uh, yeah, try it out see if it works or not plus you know uh, once you need a health regen if uh, you know his lone health you, we can also use that one uh, okay we're gonna go back here and we are going to go to warriors guild uh, and he will l uh, teach us some skills uh, he's going to teach us a uh, bow skill that's the most important one and uh, we are going to go back to our blacksmith I believe he can teach us leather armor skill okay here we go uh, so uh, we're gonna equip this item and uh, this item to Serena. Uh, yeah, let's just uh, do a little experiment. See, uh, she her fireball does 18 to 26 fire damage. Uh, with her, okay, let's oh, sorry. Uh, let's buffer. Uh, so 1826 becomes uh, 2838 right now. And should we equip this one, it will go even higher so it will go 36 to 45 fire damage uh, let me see if I have enough skill yes I do I have enough skill to reach uh, level 5 and with level 5 uh, we will be able to become an expert 
in a skill. So whenever you ha uh, reach uh, level 5 in a skill you will be able to become an expert. Uh, you, the only thing you have to do is find the teacher and uh, we are going to find the teacher and pay 500 gold. So that's why I told you we will need gold. Uh, let's see now, we have expert fire and we are going to pay 500 gold for expert fire. Uh, now we have 45 to 54 damage but this is buffed. Uh, this is now expert uh, inner fire so it's going to be 57 to 66 which is incredible so now we have this uh, this amazing damage uh, you know Vala would probably be a lot easier uh, if we had this one before uh, next we are going to go to the uh, elemental guild we have found the gem in the tomb of Vala and we are going to solve the quest she will thank, it, thank us for it and uh, we are going to get a reward and uh, so now we have to look for the hierarch in Riverstride. So we completed this quest. Uh, this is actually the quest uh, for sorceress. Uh, it's a part of a quest chain uh, which consists of uh, let's say four uh, major quests with many other you know smaller steps in each of the quests uh, once we complete it we will be able to choose to prom uh, choose a promotion for our sorceress uh, which will further enable her um, you know to learn more you know uh, more skills and more spells so for now uh, yeah I do believe we are done here we don't you know we we can uh, also for example sell uh, some things that we don't need, you know, useless junk like these rings. We can sell it for gold. Um, you know, as we move forward, uh, inventory is going to become a big issue for us. So I hope that, uh, you know, um, there is that fine balance, you know, at, at, at some point you will, um, you will lose money. Uh, you lose money if you don't uh, pick up the items but on the other hand you cannot uh, carry everything so try uh, you know try to find that balance uh, or you know <laughs> if you wanna if you are you know if you feel like it you can go back to town uh, each time your inventory is full and sell it uh, so let's learn uh, why not since he is going to uh, since he is going to be our, let's say, designated roguelike character, he's going to use dagger. Uh, we and dagger benefits a lot from evade. Uh, we can teach him leather armor and give him, you know, some leather armor to wear. It will make him more durable. Plus, you know, it will it will be very useful because when once we reach leather expert it's going to add our evade rate to our evade rating and um, also expert dagger skills uh, will also give us um, more uh, you know more flexibility and some of the dagger skills are procced uh, once you evade an attack so they work like counters um, anyway, since now we have, uh, you know, our Seri Serena is pretty buffed, we can just do this one test. Uh, okay, 50 damage, why not? It's not a problem, she's just gonna, you know, one-shot this minion. So now you can see, uh, you know, she is pretty much, um, you know, overpowered. Uh, the only problem is, you know, uh, mana as a resource and having to rest frequently. So uh, this concludes uh, today's video. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it uh, once again. Uh, take care and hope to see you in game.